Today, we're featuring the Tyrant Terminator Audits channel. Please check out the links in the description to watch the full original video, visit his channel, and get subscribed for more of his awesome content. Yeah. You can't here. Really? I can't hear you. Really? Are you sure? Yeah. I'm pretty sure I, I'm within the legal. Really? Are, are, are you, um, really? Uh, can I have a dialogue with you? Well, this is, I'm, all I'm doing is I'm an independent journalist and I'm gathering content for a story on this DMV. So I'm, I'm, this is my fish. Uh -huh. You gotta shut that off though. Well, this is my first amendment right, sir. You, you can't, you know. Like I went, I went through this already in the city of Waukegan and I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm pretty sure I'm allowed to do what I'm here to do. Oh, Karen. Wow, Karen, right? Yes. Yeah, yeah actually. So it'd be great. You know what? People's, it'd be, people, yeah, on, sir. people's personal information is here. Okay. You can't film it. Would you want somebody filming your personal information? R no. Real quick, Karen. I'm, okay, it's fine. Come on. Real quick. Yeah. I understand. Uh, yeah, you, like you said, we've been through this, correct? Yes. So you are familiar when Walt Egan came, they said I had a right to do it. Yes, and he got in trouble because he Total was wrong. Trouble. Because I called the... Bootlicker. Come on. He's uh, now calling the customer's did you, names. Did you hear him call me a jerk? He said something to him. Thank you, okay. thank you, but thank that you. that doesn't mean he answers you can't, back. You can't, I can't answer back. Can't, not, <laughs> wow. You can't record on the property, though. Well, as you can see... And I know when you went to Waukegan, I... We did, I think I one of us I can't remember if it was me. I think I showed up after Waukegan after was, gone. was gone. I don't think you did. After yeah, Waukegan and yeah, you were you gone. Were already gone. You had walked out the back. You were Okay, so let me let me just get this right. What's your name? Shemansky. Officer Shemansky? Are you are you not an officer? He yeah, is an officer. Okay. GBC. Well I'm just from Maxon. Okay, and what's your badge number? Nine one nine. Nine one nine. So you're saying even though Waukegan told me I have a right to do it, which I already know I do. No, by the First not Amendment. Not it's a constitution. This is a public I building. I understand, but it's a government facility and they have personal information in there. I'm not recording any personal but information. You, but you can't record in there for the man, zone manager. This is, this. is What's amazing is this is the same young lady that was at the other site where she was educated that I could. But I wasn't so there, because I called the chief of police and you can call him in Waukegan. And that officer got in trouble because he's incorrect. I also called the court <coughs> and a lawyer and... He was incorrect. You cannot film inside this building. Really? Really. Even though he was told I could. That's the yeah, part that I'm... Made, that's... He made a mistake. He, he did not... He, he did... He had... Because no, I asked him where he got the information. Uh -huh. He says, I Googled it. Okay, we got to get back to work. You what? can't record in there. Well, I'm going to come in and record. I'm, no, I'm, you're not. I am. I am definitely am. Because okay. I have a First Amendment right to do it. You can't... I'm not going to let you guys and friends on my rights. Personal information in the building. And I'm promising not to record people's personal information. You I'm just, just you, I'm just going to stay in the public accessible areas. I'm not going to record any you're computers. You're not in there for business. You can't be in there. I'm in there for business. Thank you. I no, just you're told not. you. I am. No, you're not. We had this discussion. I, I am in there. No, this we didn't have this discussion today. What's your name again? I already told you once. What can you call a supervisor? Because I'm going to come in and record. You, 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 the, you can't come in and record, sir. What, what can you, what can, like I said, can you call your supervisor? I tried. I didn't get in touch with him. So what? I'll tell you what. As soon as I get in touch with him, I'll, put, I'll get you his number. You well, how long do I supposed to wait around for that? As soon as I can get in touch with him. Because now my rights are being infringed on. I'm not going to allow that. You, you can't come in here and record data. If you're not in here doing Secretary of State business, Karen said you're, they don't want you in here. This is a direct violation of the Constitution, sir. Okay. Well, then you can talk to Deerfield also. See what they have to say. I gave you the opportunity to contact my boss. Yeah, but your boss, I, you talked to him today, right? Your, your sergeant? Yeah. I mean, obviously, he didn't say I was doing anything nefarious or it, it had any ill intent. Why today, don't you right? call my boss if I got his number for you? Like an, it, for what? It's purposeless. What I'm calling him for? Because when you're on the inside, it's Secretary of State property on the inside. State, outside, right? State property. Sec, yeah, state right. property. State right. property. So what, which makes it public, correct? Can we agree but on when that? When you're in there, when you're in there, I'm not going to agree on anything. When you're oh, in there, there's okay. personal information. Okay. Well, okay. I, I'm not recording personal information. But when you're in there, there's personal information given out. I don't know what you're recording. If, Just stand if, in a public accessible area. If, if you don't have state business, they do not want you in there. State business for driver's license or vehicles. How you doing, officer? Hi. I'm meeting you or you? Meet with me. You're a sergeant? You're a sergeant? Yes, sir. Oh, okay. What's your name and badge number? Greg Hurry, 
3900 right, I appreciate that. This is the situation, right? I'm here today at the DMV. I'm just exercising my First Amendment right to record in public for a possible publication, a story that I'm working on here. Um, not this young man particularly, but the, another young man in there told me that it's some policy that doesn't allow it. But it's three things with a policy. Policy is not law. Policy doesn't have the force of law. And if I chose to ignore the policy, that's not breaking the law. So I tried to convey that to them. However, they, you know, the level of ineptitude here today is astronomical. Okay. <laughs> I'm just being honest. Okay. You know, I'm not, I don't have any ill intent, nothing nefarious going on, sir. Just, just right? trying to peacefully respect, uh, exercise my rights. Several weeks ago, I was at the Waukegan DMV. Okay. And um, a manager by the name of Karen, she, she actually works here now, and she, she's oh, here. Okay. You know, while Keegan came and educated everyone there that I had the first, I had a First Amendment right to record in public. But okay. to, told them to leave me alone, and the same young that, lady is here today trying to infringe again. There was apparently <laughs> some backstory to that that she had mentioned to him. I wasn't really familiar with. Okay. Where it's, the officer and I, she talked to the chief and yada yada yada. But they, don't, if you don't, if you're not there on state business license, ID, real ID vehicle stuff they don't want mm -hmm. you inside that's okay. just it i'm here on official business what's your official business with the state of illinois other than doing your story which is an official I'm, business i'm at work sir appointment. i'm at work so am i and so is so, the so that's what i'm saying you can't but infringe on my rights sir here's the karen here this, this is the karen is she karen. was educated just several weeks ago and no in fact I to know however can you stop for a minute please you have disrupted business in there you are now sorry. disrupting business out oh. here can you disrupt business out here? I'm yes, not, you I, can. By, by recording? What, what do we need to finish today? Oh, this what, what can this, I help with? This is what I want, you're a law enforcement officer. Yes, sir. Same thing as like I told that young man. It's law enforcement. Uh, yeah, the uniform? Yes. Yeah, the uniform. We don't, we don't want you guys to get in the habit of coming to these public properties and forcing their policy. Because you guys are law enforcement, not policy enforcement. Right, right. right. So you guys sworn oath to uphold the Constitution. Mm -hmm. Me recording in public is part of the Constitution, which is the First Amendment. Unfortunately for them, fortunately for us, I would love for you to educate these people and let them know that what I'm doing is not illegal. Yeah. So, what you come in here when you're recording? Is that what set alarms yeah, I'm just, off for them? Yeah, I'm just, I'm just trying to con uh, gather content like a, for a story. Um, how do we resolve today? How do well, can, if he's not you, in there, for are you, are you done? Are you, I'm sorry. Are you done with what you need to do? To be perfectly honest, I'm with that side, because I didn't know it was two sides. I know yeah, uh, that's drivers like registration. Vehicle. I'm done with that side. I was just going to get get, get a couple more. If you're not in there on business for your license or whatever, you're you're not going inside. And I understand you're working. I get that. I respect that. We're working here, the three of us. You, okay. you can't go in there if you're not in there on state business. Well, then you know if you if you don't allow me to in there, sir. That's infringing on my First Amendment right. It is. And you're doing it right here in front of a law enforcement officer. He's, he's law enforcement, too. Yeah, yeah but I'm, I'm just saying, though. I'm just saying. What I'm saying is it's going to come down on you personally. Not, nothing's going to come down to me in person. It will, sir. You're no, violating not. a clearly established law, sir. You know what that means? Your qualified immunity is out of there. You, okay. That's funny? Okay. You're laughing yeah, at freedom, sir? And liberties? Funny. It is funny. And you're a law enforcement. we've told you if, wow. you're there, you, you, if you're not in there for business to get a license... An ID or whatever they can supply you with here. Real we ID, heard, ID. I heard you. I heard that. Okay. But, then but if guess what? Me, I don't have to be there. It, apparently. I don't have to be here for that, sir. To go inside, you certainly do. Absolutely not. This is a public building. I'm not going to keep conveying this back and forth. I understand you. it's a public building. Uh, again? Like I said, again, I'm here Give conducting journalism business. So I'm here. To the the line for Secretary of State he told me to get in the line. Don't cut anyone. I said a line. I, I said this is a disabled senior pregnant woman. Right. Line. right. I said you can, something about the line. I couldn't prove it. Say what's the deal? You're right. Now. That's true. So that's why I'm here. I haven't cut anyone. You're not conducting Secretary of State business. Well, he he just told me something else. Yeah, I got police is here to prove it. And he said, long as I stand in line, I will be good to go. I believe I said they're going to check your documents, and if you're not in there on Secretary, that's not what he said. That's not what he said. What documents do you have to show that you have business here? I don't. I do. I have a. I have official business here because I'm recording in public, sir. First Amendment right. I don't care about your recording. Well, that's all I'm doing. I'm a journalism. Okay. 
I understand you're a journalist. Sure I get it. Mm -hmm. But if you're not in here yeah. conducting okay. business, you as well, right? okay. Just sir, well, but what's your name, sir? Everyone here is doing business. What, here is doing business. What's your name? What's your name? My name is James. What's yours? James what? Just James for now. Okay. You don't need my. What's your name? What's your name? Just sergeant. Yes, sir. So there's no, uh, there's no level of professionalism here. You came here being, you want to be, you're a tyrant today, sir. I mean, if you don't have business here, but not stuff, what do you want to go and type? I just told you. Why we keep going everyone, over that? Everyone here has has business. There. And I do too. Inside. You can't, you can't Secretary determine what State. what I got to do is not business, sir. Okay. You can't. Secretary of State business. Yeah, that's why I'm here. What is it? <laughs> to show me the document. Gather the content and disseminate it to the public. Secretary of State's business information. That's exactly why I'm here. So, that's, all, that's all you're going to do? That's it. So and you're going to go in there and look at people's information? I'm not going to look at any people's information. I'm going to look what's available to the public and disseminate what? it. Okay. What Whatever's exactly, available. What particularly you got pamphlets in there. I can help you out. I'll get you some pamphlets. I, I don't need to. I'm not disabled, sir. I don't see. I'm not, I'm not broken by the if foot. You were in the disabled line. Well, you got a calculus of ways you can be disabled. I'm not physically disabled. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Physically. Right? right. You. There you go. So we're going to change, change it to accommodate you. I'll, I'll bring out everything you need. I don't need you to. I appreciate it. It's a gesture, but I don't need, I don't need any help. Okay. I just I just want to be able to do it unmolested. Unmolested? Yeah. So if you want to, if you want to get a couple pamphlets, you can go inside, get them, get the pamphlets, and come on out. Yeah, if, if you don't, if you don't need. If you don't conduct any further business and these employees uh, you know, don't want you there, you're not going to be alone. You're going to have to leave. Yeah, I'm a, I'm like, I, like I just told this young man in, in Deerfield Police, I, I'm, I'm just going to go in there like I've been trying to do for two hours. Gather content. Here's what, how about this? How about and I'm leaving. Since you have no business, you're not getting an ID, license, or renewal of any kind, right? Not today. Okay. Why well, don't to bypass the line why don't i go in there we'll go in there with her i'll go in there with you together i don't need you to babysit me though uh, i just need you guys' names badge numbers i already gave it to you once i, I just can't pronounce it i don't want to mess it up and be I gave it to you, you can review the tape okay well let me just get it like this you don't mind dude. Yeah, look Shemansky. look at this guy look at this guy i mentioned my head <laughs> oh my god Shemansky. what's your name again sergeant espionosa did i get it right you got it perfect what's your what's your badge number 0288. 0228. So I'm just going to file fish complaints on you guys, man, because y'all tried to come here and infringe, man. You talk about babysitting the public, man, while I conduct the First Amendment right. I, you know, there's no expectation. Sure you, you had no business in here. Well, you weren't going to get an ID uh, license or, uh, I mean, you were going to get pamphlets. How was long when you get pamphlets? Yeah, but you, obviously someone called you and told you I can do what I can, do, what I had a right to do. No. They had to because you, you, your, your, your whole position changed. But that's okay. Your That's, position changed too. No, it didn't. I said you were in the handicap line. Now you're not the uh, disabled line. Then you said you wanted business, but then you said you just wanted pamphlets. So right, that's position, gather. I said from the beginning. I said I wanted to gather content. Right? No. Yes, I did. And I'm gathering content for a story on this DMV. And I'm gathering content for a story on this DMV. Yes, I did. It's crazy, but you guys have a nice one, man. All right, man. All right. Take care. For sure. Please don't forget to click the links in the description for the full original video and also visit the Tyrant Terminator Audits channel, get subscribed, and enjoy more of his great content. Thanks guys.